I suppose it all started when the smog fell upon the lands. Before the streets lay dead and I had found work as a detective. They could find me in my office. They had asked my hand in work. In return, they gave me money, to which I spent on the devil's powder. One of the last purities I'd ever see. The city was quiet, murdered, sprawled throughout the city. Betrayed by the beauty they had put in power. The beauty they trusted, who they trusted to. Before the panic, she had came to me. My last job and symbol of hope. The sick cried out on the roads, begging for the embrace of the Reaper, choking on the air that they had once loved. But to that I ignored, for the mistress in front commanded the room. Her sway, her body, blood rushed, and I loved. She asked for a simple request, to find the cause of the smoke. What was purging the land of color and its life? I began to work. First the factories which spewed out the vile smoke, then to the forest which inhaled the poison clouds. The internet years ago had raged in debate about the smoke, but I had become silent like the ones who ruled the boards. Days, then weeks, then months. Nothing to show, nothing to tell. My body began to wither and melt away, only for my discovery. She had just doomed us all. She had sucked the wonder of this world and absorbed it into her luscious body. It wasn't hard to pick up my old cold metal once more. It wasn't hard to use it against the monster on the other end. When she came back, I told her what I knew. The destruction of the earth, the rising of the seas, the falling of the forests. I still remember her last words. Nothing lasts forever.